Today we're gonna to take a look at a new phone mount that has just come out for Concept2 monitors and whether or not it is worth your hard-earned money. For your workouts. I'm Shane Farmer, this is Dark Horse Rowing where you build the life that you wanna live and we use rowing to help you get there. Do you use YouTube videos to help you row? Have you tried using some kind of online training program to help you get better or set a plan? Or do you just like listening to music perhaps while you row and you found some odd ways of trying to secure your phone. Maybe you put it on a chair or you lean it against a book or set it on the ground over in the corner or you watch a TV mounted to a wall or something like that. You've come up with your own solutions to try and keep your phone in place. Well, there has been a phone mount that has been available and widely used, but it was really the only one in the space that is until now. Check that out. Enter the Vapor Fitness phone mount for PM5 monitors. Now the PM5 monitor is what Concept2 uses across all of their machines, the ski erg, the bike erg, and the row erg as well. They all use the same monitor now. So this will fit all of those machines. I've tested it on all three and yes, it does fit. It fixes a problem that many of us didn't know we had if you've been using the plastic phone mount for PM5 monitors. That issue being those mounts were flat on the bottom here. Now the problem with that flatness is that almost every phone now has buttons on the side. Mine has a lock button or a power button and a volume up down, that's my iPhone. And almost every phone now has those. The problem came in in that when you would put it in centered on that mount, it would either turn the volume all the way up, turn it all the way down or lock the phone. And the solution was that the phone always had to be sitting out to the side of the mount. Now is that a big headache? No, it still held the phone but you know, that's what design is, it's, it's iterating and it's finding small solutions to pain points and that was a pain point that I guess I'd never really expressed or knew that I had. Now, what they've done to fix that, and I think this is just absolutely brilliant, you can see here, it's that little ridge right there. That ridge separates the side of the phone from the base and elevates it just enough that you don't hit any buttons. Big win for everybody. Now, just like reviewing this thing in general, I do like that because it's silicone, it's nice and flexible. What that means as well is that I'm never worried about breaking it. Whereas plastic, I feel like if I stretch it too far, I'm always worried about snapping plastic. So this is going to be able to adjust to fit any size phone that you may have. Obviously, it's not going to be able to fit a tablet, but phones, you're just fine on that. Because it's silicone as well, it has a natural grippiness, which also gives me a lot more confidence that the phone isn't going to slide out or the mount isn't going to slip off the monitor. I am also a big fan of the color. It comes in black and this, uh, what I call concept two green. You can see it matches both my lighting, which I have matching the handles, which are concept two green color. So it comes in this and or black and the price point, the price point, the price point on this, it's $16.99 versus $13.99 for the plastic mount. Now, there's also, if you wanted full installation of this, you could pay Amazon $89 as well for their installation option. But with that being said, a $3 difference to me to fix a pain point I didn't know I had, that was an itch that every time my phone was offset, it always just kind of irked me a little bit. And I just think this is a brilliant iteration on an idea and they did a nice job thinking it through. So congrats to Vapor Fitness on that. Now it's also important I note, this isn't a sponsored video, nor did they even give me this. I, funny enough, I received this in the mail from whom I don't know because there was no from sending address on it and I actually reached out to Vapor Fitness to say thank you if it was them and it wasn't. So whoever you are that sent this to me, Thank you. And I've had the chance to use this for about a month now and I've moved it between all machines, tested on all of them, and I, it just does a fantastic job. It does what it's supposed to do. It, I've never had a worry that it's going to fall off or my phone is going to fall out. And so uh, from that perspective, it's gotten a good testing here at Dark Horse HQ. Now, before I give my final assessment on this, two things. Number one, of course, I linked this in the description below. So if you wanna go check it out on Amazon, check that link below, and two, I wanna hear from you, what is the craziest setup that you've had to do to keep your phone in place so that you could use it during a workout? I've heard a lot of crazy ideas and I'm really interested to know what you have done to make your phone work for you. So my final thoughts on this, is this a buy? Is this something that is worth putting into your rotation? I'm gonna say an absolute stamp of yes on this. 
I've been using it for a month now. I throw it in my gym bag when I go down to the boathouse to row in case I need to erg. It has been sitting on every single one of my machines and whenever I move machines, I find that even though I have the plastic mount, I'm still using this one and moving it from machine to machine. It just gives me confidence. And at $16.99, the $3 difference to me is well worth it for you to pick something like this up. Again, I'm just a big fan. It's, it's solved a problem I didn't know I had, but was existing. And uh, just kudos to Vapor Fitness for making a good product here. So if you're thinking about picking up this mount, number one, make sure you subscribe so you get alerted when we come out with new videos. And number two, check out this playlist of our top workouts from 2019 so that you have an amazing lineup of workouts that you get to watch in your new phone mount.